Are there more issues surrounding Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star's conspiracy palette? We'll tell you what's going on and talk about Jeffree's cryptic finale tweet. I'm Kelsey Banis and you're watching The Daily Report. Happy Friday, we get the finale today. Whew. On November 1st, Shane Dawson and Jeffree Star launched a makeup bundle that would break the internet, literally. The palette, mini palette, lipsticks, and the gloss quickly sold out everywhere, and now that fans are starting to get their packages in the mail, some are noticing issues. As we reported on Monday, many fans who ordered from the website Beauty Bay have been getting cracked palettes with eyeshadow everywhere due to little to no bubble wrap surrounding the palette, allowing it to bounce around inside the box it was shipped in. When one fan tweeted asking if they were really shipping palettes with no bubble wrap, Beauty Bay wrote back, quote, we are committed to improving sustainability sustainability as a business, so wherever possible we limit our plastic usage in favor of recyclable materials. The alternative we use can be recycled in your local recycling. Okay, at least they responded, right? Now, Shane has tried to jump in on some of the tweets, pointing this out to get Beauty Bay's attention, but in some cases, there may be no replacement available as the palette is sold out everywhere, so all fans are offered as a partial refund. On one cracked palette, Jeffrey also jumped in, tweeting, quote, I'm so sorry how the situation was handled. That does not reflect our company's personal policies. We are handling this internally, but in the meantime, please direct message me so I can send you a new palette right now myself. And it's so nice of him to do that, but that may only be one of how many? However, cracked boxes aren't the only issue right now. We may be experiencing a Jaclyn Hill problem. I know, a throwback. Remember when Jaclyn launched her lipstick collection and fans were finding mold, plastic, and or hairs all over it? Ugh, just give me chills. Ugh. She tried to pawn off the hair as remnants of the gloves the workers used, putting it all together, and eventually gave refunds. Well, now fans are finding some hairy palettes too, from Shane and Jeffrey. And they aren't from one specific company the way the cracked palettes are from Beauty Bay. They are coming from all over. One fan tweeted, quote, Hey Jeffrey, I love the hashtag conspiracy palette, but I was swatching the pigment and found a hair-like material in it. I just wanted to address the issue and hopefully get it resolved. And another fan tweeted that they found a hair in their mini controversy palette. No word yet on if anything will be done or if there is an explanation for this, but we do have word on the finale of the series. Yesterday, Shane announced on Twitter that the beautiful world of Jeffree Star would be ending today. We don't know what time yet, but he tweeted a photo of a man behind him and Jeffrey and wrote, quote, finale tomorrow featuring my favorite bodyguard, which is super fun, but it was Jeffrey's follow-up tweet that was way more intriguing. He wrote, quote, tomorrow, expect the unexpected. We are not playing games. What does that mean? Will we get to see the drama? Oh my gosh, it all ends here, so it's a now or never, and I am so excited. But we wanna know what you think. Are you ready for the series finale? Let us know in the comments below, and as always, don't forget to subscribe to Awesomeness TV and the Awesomeness TV Daily Report channel. I'm Kelsey Banis, and oh my gosh, I don't even know. I just don't want it to end.